Hey guys, welcome to my newest video. That's from so I think her I don't remember what her YouTube is, but it's like Cassie from Daily Bumps, Missy's sister. She always says that in her videos. So I got packages today. But I'm just gonna open up these smaller ones first since they're here. This one's from Etsy. Uh her shop is like Sparrow and Run or something. I don't know why, like bought from her I just did I don't know why honestly but whatever I always love her packaging if you guys can see this it's cute so I got two shirts okay let me just rip it from this direction I guess but she had like a here's the order slip remember what she had. I saw this on Leah, of course, of all dolls. And I needed to have it for her. Is my camera even focusing on this? I have no idea. Oh, there it goes. And then there's this one. There's like stuff all over it, but okay. Oh my gosh, I love the little pocket. But she also had this one on Leah as well. As you can see, there's like shiny metallic, like... Yeah, you can see that. It's so pretty. This will go on Leah eventually. She's in Mary Ellen's meat dress right now, and I'm currently dying because she's so cute in it. So I got that, and then I got some stuff to make another custom doll that I've been kind of obsessing over. So this is the wig. Oh, this is so cute look at this and it comes with a little hair bow you can like barrette into your doll's hair that's adorable and i'm not gonna lie inside it has their card this little envelope is so cute watch so i got a wig from beautifully custom and then there's all their contact stuff um if you want them to make a custom doll for you i want to say they're more expensive than britland madison because they do custom dolls too so i would go i would do both actually i would ask for a quote from either and see which one would be cheaper for you but i got a wig this one's going to be temporary since i don't have her real wig yet how do you open this Am I like, oh there we go, like an envelope, that's cool. So they didn't have the actual wig that I wanted in stock, so I'm going to like kind of wait and see what happens. But this is the Sunflower Blonde and it's heat safe, which is cool. Oh wow, this is like a lot different color than I thought it was going to be. Hoping it'd be like more blonde or something. I don't remember if I've gotten one of their wigs before or not, but this one has a part. Wow, this is so heavy and it's so soft. Oh my gosh. It's so soft, you guys. Like, I wish you could feel this because honestly, it's so soft. And it's heat safe, which is really cool. So you can like curl it, straighten it more if you don't want, you know, like the little curvy ends. This one's gonna be temporary until I can get this doll a longer wig. I don't know if I'm gonna just do like a separate opening video and then make a separate like customization video because this video will be like 30 minutes long probably, which I'll never be able to upload at my house. I go back to school the 22nd, so I know when you try to save money and you find a cute custom and you just wanna make her and then you end up being broke again. I don't know how people my age have their own apartments, like do their parents help them pay for it or what, I have no idea. My parents wouldn't, they'd be like, eh, you're on your own, sucka. Yep, I know what doll this is. She's not wearing clothes. She has her underwear though, which is really good. I got a 61 for really cheap, I want to say she was like 80 something. She's like brand new. And you're probably like, wait, why do you have 61? 
uh, I will be using her eyes for this custom that I'll be making, but she's like brand new, guys. And once I eye swap her, I'm just going to sell the 61 with this doll's eyes, which obviously I'll show you in whenever I get this box open. Oh, is this her book? Probably what this is. I won't be showing you her book because I'll just give her away. Oh my gosh. They put the... I want to say this is... I don't even know what this is. Oh, it's the mini doll. Okay. They put her in a phone box. That's really funny. So this came with her, but it's a mini Marie Grace, which I might keep her actually. She's kind of cute. Add her to my mini doll collection. And then here's the doll. You might be able to tell who it is. I can open this first. Mary Grace! She smells pretty good, actually. She smells like... Mm, I don't know, but it smells good. Is it weird when you buy a doll and you smell them? So here's Mary Grace. She's going to be the base doll of, for this custom. So if you guys want to try to guess what I'm going to try to make, go ahead, feel free. She will be having this hair. And hopefully, yeah, hopefully I can get the longer one because this one's definitely not long enough. But I just got it for now. Um, and then I'll probably sell it or something. I don't know. But, yeah, where did I just put that? Oh, she's over here. Awkward. And then she'll have... Mary Grace will have her eyes. So, customization video will happen for her. And then, for this custom doll, I had a dress made for her. It's not done yet. Oh, here's her book, by the way. I had a dress made for her on Etsy, so that'll come eventually. And then her underwear will go on her because I need underwear for my dolls since Mary Grace doesn't have, um, you know, like the normal underwear, like this modern day underwear. She has her pantaloons or whatever they're called. I don't even know. But this before this video gets, before it gets longer, I'm going to go. It's probably uninteresting, honestly, because I'm talking kind of quietly because my brother's sleeping in the other room. Both my brothers were sleeping at one point, but my older younger brother woke up not too long ago, and then my baby brother is still sleeping, so he's taking his nap. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will have a customization video up as soon as I can, um, so watch out for that. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please comment, rate, and subscribe, and I'll talk to you in the next video. Bye!